High speed and agility overcame barriers on and off the track. He's the Indianapolis native known as the fastest cyclist in the world. Where is Sherman? He is downtown for a tribute to a sports icon, Major Taylor. You know the name, right? Major Taylor? Marshall Major Taylor, fastest cyclist in the world. Yeah, well, anyway, hey, there's an exhibit in his honor right now here at the Indiana State Museum. It is so significant. Uh, not only was he the fastest cyclist, but he's really it was a historic figure in many, many ways. Okay, I'm going to shut up so I can get the person who can tell us more <laughs> about it. Hello, Kisha. Kisha Tandy is a curator here, Indiana State Museum. This exhibit honoring Marshall Major Taylor. Yes, Marshall Major Taylor was born here in Indianapolis, November 26, 1878. He would begin his career here as a young trick rider, and then he would become a champion sprinter. And by 1899, he would be the world one-mile champion. Right, and there's his image. Okay, yes. this is the interest to the exhibit. They really depict several images of him. Yes. Uh, but this is a re really representative of the community that's involved in this exhibit. Yes, definitely. We had several artists who came together to work on this project. The images that you see now were put together by local artist Walter Loban Hamilton. And he came in and actually looked at the museum collection, selected many images, and put it together to help tell the story of Major through art. Uh -huh. And you hear the words of poet January Yark, who wrote the poem a major deal to tell his life in a very succinct way that's really cool yes um, so some of the some of the images and some of the things that you see I should say mm -hmm. donations uh, uh, from yes. the family yes some of your collection here mm -hmm. as yes. well yes. and then we have this now this was his yes. bike now is this part of your collection or no so this bike is from the United States Bicycle Hall of Fame it is the only bike that we know of that exists that Major Taylor rode and this bike was a bike that he used in his European wow. successful campaigns uh -huh. and it is from believed to be about 1903 Okay, so for cyclists out there, mm -hmm. we say fast. How fast was he going? Like his mile, how fast was that? So in November of 1899, he had a mile at a minute 19. A minute 19? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes. and riding something like that? He would have been riding something, oh, something similar, very similar to that. Maybe yes. Uh, so if you were familiar with the Major Taylor Velodrome, which is now an Indy Cycleplex, so that was uh, built in his honor, well, I think it's 1982. Yes. Um, but mm -hmm. that sits still today. Yes. Uh, in yes. honor of this fastest guy who mm -hmm. really went through a lot of social issues as he traveled around the country and around the world. Definitely. Major Taylor faced what he called the dreadful monster prejudice. And he experienced this throughout the United States. But today we recognize his legacy. We honor Major Taylor. The Major Taylor Velodrome is one of those ways in addition to the new mural that is up downtown town and just the inspiration that he provides to many of the riders. Many. Look, here yes. he is, 5'7", riding like that. Okay, <laughs> we've got more coming up because there's some interactives where you can test your skills at riding too. Yeah, indoors. That's coming up later.